Hi everybody, I have another trifle for you guys. Uh, I turned off the fan so we have to be quick in here because it's really, really warm. So when I go thrifting, I don't really have anything in mind. So I just go with the flow and see what I can find and praying that there's something high quality and really affordable price. Go with like the sweatshirt, jacket, skirt, and dresses. Not much off the tops because I just go uh, basics, just a basic stop. And also I've been going to H&M for some basic items that I really love. So here is what I found. Got some corduroy jacket, like this cardigan, stretch, stripes, more stripes, and sweatshirts. So let's start with the first thing that I found in the store. So they're in sale. I thought they're gonna be new arrivals, and I love going there for like their new stuff. Even though they're more money, I uh, I kind of try to justify it because if I love it, I'm going to buy it if I can afford it, right? So the first thing is this vintage. That's a brand, Isprit, or I don't know how to pronounce that. But this is a corduroy jacket. It's I know that it's vintage because they have this tiny cell phone pocket. You know that. And also there's a... Oh yeah, just that. Oh, there's a pocket over here, like a hidden pocket on the inside. And the lining, yeah, I think it's going to be warm. So it's a black corduroy jacket. Also got some pockets in the front. I'm sure if you could see this, but yeah. And here's the back. Oh, I think it's dark. I'm trying to. And also got this, uh, the red bag in here. But yeah, that's the first one, and I got this for 109 pesos because they're on sale. But yeah, I'm very, very happy with the fit. I try it with it like I'm wearing an oversized shirt and just, uh, I'm wearing, I forgot, jeans. Okay, so the next thing I found, there's no brown in this one, but this is. It kind of oversized cardigan. I don't know if you could see the texture of it. Like there's like, I'm gonna try to go closer. But yeah, it's a kind of knit, oversized cardigan. There's no packets, but I really love how oversized it is. I'm gonna try to do a try on or a styling video. But yeah, I really love the style of this one. Oh, it's also, it's a little bit itchy, but not too itchy. I think I can live with it. <laughs> and another one is this, I would say it's a short trench. I tried to search it in Pinterest and see how to style it. Because like I said, I was wearing an oversized shirt and it re looks really good. I really love the color. It's just beige and also a big turtle, sh uh, turtle shell button. Got, I think I got pockets uh, on the sides. And also got this, like a straps on the bridge area that you could adjust. But yeah, I really love that. And at the back, uh, the belt is gone. So yeah, you're just very lucky to find a jacket or trench coat that would belt with it. I really love this. I can get away wearing this here in the Philippines because it's just so lightweight. It's very, very lightweight. So I guess when it's like, uh, when I go to the mall or maybe it's gloomy outside and maybe it's gonna rain, I could wear this because the material material is like a rain jacket. Yeah, but I love that. I love the color. I love everything about this. I wish I could find something uh, lightweight, uh, lightweight trench coat because I sold the, the one that I uh, found before because it's very long and heavy and I don't want to go to the sensors to take it in and because I was thinking I could find something that you know that fits me perfectly but yeah that's that so the jacket and uh oh those two are like the cardigan and yeah the cardigan and also the trench is 50 pesos and the sweatshirts are three for 100 so i also got this uh, black and white stripes with this concept oh it's really good in camera and it's very lightweight and you got this uh oversized sleeves yeah, I love that. I also love this black details in the color area. The brand is 80.com. And the inside is like those sweater or sweatshirt material, but lightweight. Yeah, so I got that. And also I found this... Oh, this is really soft, but it's very high quality. 
Yeah, so I love this. I love the color. It's uh, olive green and gray. Uh, the inside of the hood is different. Like the fabric is different. It's very, very thick and really soft. I love that. And also, I love this extra detail. Because most of the sweatshirt or hoodie sweatshirt is like nothing like that. So it's nice to have like that extra details. And also the front has this HCO and the logo of Hollister. And also got pockets over here. This is very long. This is size uh, medium. But I guess it's just oversized. Oh, I just love how soft it is. Yeah. So this is another collection. Very happy with what I got. Okay, so this one, you know, that I love uh, lavender. So I found this. I saw this before when I went there. And I didn't get this because I don't like the shape and it's not oversized. But I really, really love the... Oh, and it's also more money that time. So this time I got it for maybe 35 if you would say like this is 3 for 100. So yeah, I really love the color. I love the writing in there. But I, what I don't like about this is it's a dress. So, yeah, so maybe I can crop this and make, and use the bottom or make a skirt from the bottom. Yeah, and also the inside is really, really soft. And uh, I think this kind of material doesn't... Uh, what do you call that? Yeah, I just love the inside. It's really, really soft. So that's the brand, I think. You could send that. There we go. Yeah, I just love the color. The combination of the green and the lavender. It's just perfect. So you'll see if I will cut this or not. But I So that's it. Uh, I'm going to be doing a try on or maybe styling this because I don't have any bottoms. Okay, thank you so much for watching. Love you guys. Bye. I'm sweating already. Oh my god. Okay, hi everyone. I just want to update you guys with the sweatshirts that I'm going to grab. So, I'm very, very happy how it turns out. I thought it's going to be like so tight on me, but it really looks good. So, this is the top. I didn't cut it like too short because I don't want to show any of my, you know, if I have like the undergarments. If you feel like I'm wearing this and I lift my arm, sometimes if it's too short, it, uh, they're going to show your underwear. So I don't like that, so I just leave a little bit of fabric in here. I was gonna cut it over here, but then I tried to leave my arm and it's too short. So yeah, I just decided to cut it there. But I'm very, very happy how it turns out. And last night I was uh, showing the skirt and this is how it turns out. So so before it, this is the end, this part. But I put it like upside down and this is like the waist area. And I just trace it with my denim skirt and it, it works really good. At first I trace it with my uh, bodycon skirt, but it's just too tight. I, I know that I'm not gonna wear that and I'm just gonna be uh, keeping that in the closet. So this one is like just perfect. I love the shape of it. And I also wanted to put slits over here, but I can tell that the fabric rolls up, so it's not gonna be good. It's a, I know that if I cut it, it's just gonna turn like this. So yeah, I just decided to uh, just leave it like that. I'm very, very happy with it. But I didn't cut it yet, just in case I decided to... Yeah, I don't know yet why I didn't cut this. This is the extra fabric. So let me show you inside out of this. Okay, so that's what it looks like. The whole thing. So that's uh, where I trace it and I just sew it by hand. And yeah, I like the fit of that. And also the inside is really comfortable. I tried it on last night and I don't want to take it off. So I'm, I'm just really, really happy how it turns out. I did it before and I made the shorts, but I'm not very happy with that. So yeah, so this is a nice uh, launch set. Okay, so this is what it looks like. I mean, like I said, I'm very, very how it turns out. So I, I lifted my arm, 
I'm just gonna show that right amount of skin. And yeah, I, I think that's a fabric. You can still see that that's the extra fabric in here. But yeah, when I decided to remove that and maybe get this to the same strength, I'm not sure if I'm gonna add some elastic just to have that grip. And yeah, I'm very, very happy. It looks really cool. I can tuck it in to my bra over like that just to get that sexy dye. And uh, you can be a very good with the boots. Okay, so I'm gonna pair it with my Steve Madden boots. I really love this. 